In order to enter a case in the exam for a case list, you first will choose a category, gynecology, obstetrics, or office. Here we will choose gynecology. We'll bring up a list of a category in the category of the conditions listed in that category. Simply choose the category of the case you want to enter, click on it, and click Go. You can also double click on the condition name. You will then be brought into a white spreadsheet. Click on the Add Edit GYN record in order to enter in your patient's information. Here you enter in your patient's initials, patient hospital number, the age, gravida, para, and the amount of days in the hospital. You will then choose a hospital name. Since we don't have any hospital names indicated, it just says the dates. You will also indicate which time period you're using if you are not just using the post-residency. You will see the condition name, enter a new diagnosis, treatment, pathology, and complications in the correct tabs. By clicking on the Recommendations tab and then clicking on Check Case, you will have the example recommendations listed before you. Simple things as forgotten information or landmines that your examiner may notice will be brought to your attention here. When you're finished, simply click Finish Editing and all the information that you have thus far entered will be shown up on your spreadsheet before you. The hospital name here is not indicated. If I have entered in hospital names, there will be the correct letter A, B, C, D, or E. You'll notice in column A, the number sign is empty. As is column C, the patient number sign is empty. This information will get correlated once your report is created. In order to add another abdominal hysterectomy case, Simply click on the Add New Row below Active Cell button and another form will open. Here you will enter in the patient's information again. After this is entered in, you click Check Case or Finish Editing. Again, the information will appear on the software. In order to edit the case, click on Add Edit GYN. To move a case, click on the Move a Row button. You must have the case you want to move indicated. Then simply click on the case that you would like to move it to, highlight it, and click OK. The software will then move your case over to the specified location. By choosing another cat condition, Simply click on the gynecology section and the list of conditions will appear. Please make sure you always save the file. Recommend, recommend saving the file after every case. Click on the home button to go back to the home page of the software. You will notice the red warning at the top of the screen. This warning is there because we have not entered in any hospital names. In order to find reasons for the red warnings on the software, click on the picture of the doctor looking at the patient's mouth. The software will do a run through the entire software to find reasons for any problematic cases. It will then open up the case that is causing the red warning. You click OK and then go to the Add Edit button and it will bring up the case that is causing you a problem. This particular case is missing a hospital name. Click on the Home button to go back to the main screen.
lipstick section and the office section are pretty much the same. Choose a category, click go, and then click on the add, edit, or be record. In the obstetric section, you also have a gestational age to add. You'll also have the newborn information. Entering in the app guides, the weight, the days in hospital, and the prenatal death here is crucial. Please make sure you do it within the for forms. All the information will appear at the bottom of your screen. Add it up to the app cars, five or less, the infants under 2,500 grams, and the perinatal death. These numbers will appear again on your home screen, on your page of the report that you will create. By going to the top of the OB section, you will see where your simple vaginal delivery number will appear. This number is not entered in your OB section, but rather entered in, in the Edit Candidate Data Information next to where you entered in your hospital name. The simple vaginal deliveries are calculated from the main 12 months only. Do not enter in the number here. Please make sure it's entered in under the Edit Candidate Data Information.